Let's roll, baby. All right. <laughs> Eye tracking in UX design and research. We all know that um, research is important for the development of any product. Without feedback from users, uh, it is impossible to know if what you are making is actually helpful or not. That's why US, UX research exists to study how people interact with products and services so that designers and developers can create better user experiences. But what are the most effective methods of conducting UX research? In this video, we will take a look at one of the most popular methods, which is the eye tracking method and explore how effective it really is. Are you looking into my eyes? Good. Because when it comes to your understanding user behavior, eye tracking is one of the most powerful tools available to UX researchers. It's a non-invasive method that allows researchers to um, accurately measure where people are looking on a page or a screen and a billboard and how long they're actually looking at it for. This can provide valuable insights into how users view web pages and apps, which in turn can help designers identify issues and improve usability. But how does it really work? How does um, eye tracking work? Eye tracking is a method of measuring where a user is looking uh, physically into the screen uh, or in a physical environment. In the field of uh, user experience research, eye tracking is used to gain insight into how users interact with, um, with digital products and to identify areas of improvement. By tracking the eyes of the users and measuring their gaze, eye tracking is able to um, uh, provide valuable uh, statistics into the behavior of a user. And this could also uh, allow the designer to identify those areas on the websites that um, uh, would otherwise remain hidden if you didn't know. Um, also, uh, you are able to now understand how people are interacting with the product interface uh, and inter interactivity patterns, which can then be used to fine tune the design choices for a better uh, overall usability. So what are the types and benefits of uh, eye tracking research? There are different types of eye tracking uh, technology available, including uh, screen-based and remote uh, eye tracking. Screen-based uh, screen eye tracking uh, uses a camera to track the movement of the user's eyes while they are looking at the computer screen. Remote eye tracking, on the other hand, uses infrared technology, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, technology to track the movement of the user's experience from a distance. One of the main benefits of using eye tracking uh, in UX research is that it allows user uh, researchers to, uh, to use where, uh, where users are looking and for how long. So this information can be used to determine uh, which elements of the website and applications they need to focus on more or even spend more money at. For example, if a button or a link is located in an area of the screen where users are not looking, for example, it may be necessary to move to a more prominent location. Eye tracking can also be used to measure the effectiveness of uh, different design elements. For instance, uh, researchers can use the eye tracking uh, to compare the effectiveness of two different layouts, for example, or <clears throat> to determine the best placement for a call to action button. Um, another advantage is of the uh, advantage of the eye tracking is that it allows researchers to see how users interact with a digital product in real time. And this means that they can uh, observe how users navigate through the website or application and identify the problems or confusion they may have along the way of the journey. This is particularly useful for identifying usability, such as a poor navigation system or confusing labels. Eye tracking is valuable uh, in the research method that can uh, help you, us understand how users interact with the digital products. Um, and it can provide 
insight into users' behavior that would uh, be impossible uh, to gain through other methods. I was said by Jacob Nielsen, our renowned usability expert and, and, and one of the principals of the Nielsen uh, Norman Group. However, eye tracking research has some limitations. As you and I know, it can be time consuming and expensive to set up and execute, and it might require uh, specialized equipment uh, and trained uh, professional personnel. Moreover, it can only provide data on uh, where users are looking and not, um, and not on why they are looking there for. So eye tracking data must be complemented with other user methods such as user interviews and surveys to um, get a full understanding of the, of the behavior of the user. What is the economic impact of uh, eye tracking and user behavior? In terms of economic impact, digital billboards can be a significant source of revenue for cities with uh, revenue generated from billboards, advertising often used to fund public services and infrastructure projects. UX designer, for example, are responsible for designing user experiences, which include the navigation and flow of uh, information on a website or, or on an application. In that sense, they can be seen as the traffic controllers in the uh, sense that they are responsible for uh, directing users through the product um, in an efficient and intuitive way. The global digital out of home um, advertising marketer uh, was valued at about $32.5 billion in 2019 and is projected to reach about $49.5 billion by 2025, growing at a CAGR of 7%. There had been some research conducted at the eye tracking lab at the University of Amsterdam, uh, showing that the eye tracking can be an effective uh, tool in UX research with a reported accuracy rate up to about 95%. The results are accurate enough to identify patterns of user behavior and uh, even detect subtle changes in, in those behaviors as well. In terms of demographics, digital billboards tend to have the most impact on urban and suburban areas with the highest concentration of billboards found in areas with high population density and high traffic. <clears throat> Excuse me. According to research, also digital billboards tend to be more effective at Re reaching younger, more educated, and higher income consumers. So with that in mind, uh, understand how important eye tracking then is. The bottom line here is that advertising on the billboards can be costly investment, but it's also one of the most um, effective ways to uh, uh, reach potential customers. Eye tracking technology can help researchers understand how users interact with digital products, as well as analyze user behavior in real world settings. And with this eye tracking data, advertising can gain valuable insights into which billboard locations are generating the most attention and how they might be a better target for their ads. Therefore, investing in eye tracking technology should be seriously considered when deciding to place advertising dollars. I hope that helped. I hope that uh, you are now um, uh, more keen to uh, use the powerful tool of eye tracking and understanding how users interact with your digital products. Um, it, uh, it can provide great value to you and your organizations in terms of your marketing and selling uh, strategy. My name is Freud Perez from UX Minute Buy, and I leave you until next time.